We'll do a quick video. I know we've done a video of these vans in the past, but just to show how versatile they are. I know we put in the description the many uses, but I don't think people really realize until they think their way through these. Every one of these we have sold, the customers have been just extremely happy. A lot of people just see them as an old service truck from a Verizon or a telecommunication company, which you're right, that's what they are. These corporate companies have a ton of money. There you go, you can see the Verizon logo. Um, so they outfit these trucks very well. Most of the time they keep them until they time out, such as this one. The mileage is not bad. Um, this unit's got a built-in air compressor. Not really sure on that, but we do know that the generator works well. I'll fire that up. Um, interior's kept nice. Got some good storage inside. Seats are in good shape. 164,000 miles. And we get a pretty good supply of these in the vans and the pickups. Got an access door right here that goes through some storage, fire extinguisher for safety, document holder. Van runs out well, van's been serviced, van's been inspected. Again, they don't use, they're not perfect for everybody, but uh, trailer hitch on the back. There's your air compressor. Lots of storage, vents. Some of these even have AC built into the top. There's a whole circuit breaker uh, board there to run all the power accessories. Lots of shelving, storage areas. Ladder rack up on the roof. KUV style body so that you can slide all your stuff through here. Long materials hanging out if you need to, boards or whatever. Right here's all your plugs you can hook up power you got uh, 240 and 120 air compressor chuck as well uh, generator dependable as can be yep i had fired up again little blooper there hadn't been started in a while so let's turn it off There we go. Nice, quiet Cummins Onan generator. All self-contained in here and vented. It's the exhaust right there. See, it's not smoking or anything weird. Another plug there. Access window there. This van's 17,995, 2008 model. I would dare say the replacement of these vans now, this is an all aluminum body, so it will not rust. You probably spend $100,000 to duplicate this. Uh, turn that off before we forget. Other nice thing, it does run off the gasoline from the, van, from the van. So at a quarter tank, it cuts itself off, so you will not run the van out of fuel and be stranded. But back to this, I would say to order this van and outfit it, you're talking $100,000. Uh, more than likely a couple little paint imperfections as you can see but overall very silent again aluminum body so it will not rust it will corrode a little bit but it won't rust we got this one in stock and then we've got its uh, twin brother down here in the pickup truck version i believe both of them are oh well that's an 08 this is an 05 i just grabbed the keys for this one in mistake but uh pretty much identical setup just a little shorter body but on a pickup truck chassis dual rear wheel on this versus single rear wheel on the other but really neat setup again with the ladder system this one's got a beacon light this was also verizon um, trailer hitch got a spot on the back for a vice this one's got landing gear place to put your wheel chocks same price a little lower miles 120,000 this one's getting ready to go through detail both of them are actually storage on the side built-in generator as well so if you're looking for something for a all-around job site truck storage truck whatever your needs are 
we've had guys that use these for carpentry keep all their supplies in it run their air tools run their equipment nail guns we've had guys buy them and actually outfit them like little miniature campers mobile offices uh, welders carpenters painters really doesn't matter what you need these things are pretty well outfitted and very versatile so if you got any questions check the website for these units both of them are in stock currently and a few more in service and on the way now thanks for watching